In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to configure registration in BuddyBoss app. Before we do that, I'm going to give you a quick demo of the registration experience in the actual app. The first thing your members are going to see when they open your app is a login screen. If registration is enabled in your app settings, there will also be a sign up link under the login button. Let's go ahead and create an account by tapping on sign up. You'll see we're taken to a create account screen with a registration form for your members to fill in. If you're using BuddyBoss platform, these are the same profile fields you would see when registering from the website. If you're not using BuddyBoss platform, this registration form will still work, but will only display username, email, and password, the same fields you would see when registering from WordPress. Let's go ahead and create an account by filling these fields in. I'll start by adding an email. I'll say jane at buddyboss.com and then a password. And then a first name and a last name. And finally, I'll add a nickname. Now let's tap the create account button. It says check your email to activate your account. Notice how we've been sent to a new screen to enter a verification code. This screen will only show if you're using BuddyBoss platform. What's going to happen is a verification code is going to be added into the activation email sent by BuddyBoss after registration. BuddyBoss platform adds an activation email into the signup flow to validate the user account. Okay, so let's take a quick look at that email so we can get our verification code. So here we are on the BuddyBoss activation email. And over here, you can see that we've added some extra text. From a mobile device, enter the following code in the app or tap this link. So if we were looking at this email from an actual mobile device, we could tap this link and it would open up the app and validate us. We can also take this code and paste it into the app. Okay, we're back on the verification code screen and we're going to enter the code from the activation email. 615663. And now let's tap on submit to verify this account. You'll see the account has been verified and we've been logged in and directed to the app's home screen. Your members won't need to log in again unless they reinstall the app or log out. And that's how registration works in BuddyBoss app. Next, let's jump into the WordPress admin to see how to configure these registration settings. Here we are in the WordPress admin at settings general. The first thing we're going to want to do is to make sure that registration has been turned on in WordPress. Look for this membership section and make sure that anyone can register is checked. The app can only allow for registration if this setting has been checked as well. We can also go to the BuddyBoss platform settings at BuddyBoss and then settings. And under general, we can come down here to registration. This option for enable registration is actually synced with the other option I just showed you. And then we can also enable email confirmation and password confirmation with these two options. And these settings will sync with the app registration as well. And then let's go check out the specific registration settings for the app. We'll go into BuddyBoss app and settings. And then in this registration section, you'll see an enable registration option. To turn on in-app registration, make sure to check this box for allow registering a new account from within the app. And then if you're using BuddyBoss platform, this text for activation email body will be appended to the BuddyBoss activation email. If you're not using BuddyBoss platform, then the setting will not display. So you can edit this text here if you'd like. Just make sure to include the key code and key code link tags within your email. This tag is used to output the verification code. And this tag here is used to output the mobile verification link. And then I'll show you quickly which email this gets added into. We can go to BuddyBoss and click on emails. And then I'm going to search for the text activate. And I'll click to edit this email. The special mobile app registration text I just showed you is getting added to the end of this email. This will only happen if the user tries registering from the app. If they register from the web, they will not get the app text added. As you can see, we've taken extra care to make sure it is a smooth process for your members to register accounts on your app. And if you're using BuddyBoss platform, the registration in the app will sync seamlessly with the existing online experience. This should help to grow your communities as new members start registering to your BuddyBoss app.